In this video, we will show you how to assemble your connector and back shell. Hi, this is Chris from Garmin. Now that we have prepared our wires, stripped our wires, terminated our wires, we're ready to assemble our connector. We establish aircraft power. Aircraft ground, our CAN bus, low, and CAN bus high. And our data wires. We get ourselves a small length of some kind of chafe protection tape. and wrap our merry little band of wires up where it's going to interact with the hole down of the back shell. Just as an added measure of protection. We then install the connector in the back shell, making sure it's latched in, make sure our chafe protection is appropriately placed in the clamp down making sure our wire clamp is round side down. We then install our strain relief clamp. And assemble. We can then close up the rest of the back shell with the top. Again, ensuring complete assembly. So our back shell is finished. Our wires are no longer exposed. And then finally, we gather up our shield terminations. And affix them to our back shell. Again, following the installation manual and other approved or acceptable documentation accordingly. So here we have our completed connector. This should help you better understand the process of creating your wire harness assembly. If you have a connector that requires an integrated lightning protection module, please refer to our follow-on video, LPM Connector Assembly.